are you looking at me? Like a doctor? Because I'm a doctor. Oh, come on. I already know you're a doctor. Then why did you ask if I'm a doctor? I'm just saying you shouldn't make it look obvious. I already know. I, I know I'm in the hospital. But don't you have other patients to attend to? I do. I decided to give you special attention. I don't need you. No, you do. I don't need anyone. I'm fine on my own. <laughs> Oh, my head. Oh, sweetheart. Oh, oh. Calm down. Let the doctor help you. Easy, easy. Do you know why you're here? Yeah. Your son is in a very delicate condition. We still need to observe him to see that he's fully recovered before thinking of discharging him. So, doctor. How soon do you think this will be? I can't tell for now. Please, I beg of you. Just do everything you know you can do to ensure that my son will be all right. Please. It's OK. We'll try our best. But one thing I don't understand is how he managed to involve himself in this kind of thing. You talk as if you don't know the children of nowadays. He left the house for his friend's house. Four hours later, we got a call from his friend asking us to come. Yes, my husband is right. It's okay. I will speak with him to see what I can get. It's okay. Thank you, Doctor. We will do the needful. Please do. Please. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Doctor, please, thank you. Look at me. You guys have to be very honest in answering me. You know that, right? So who is doing the talking? Be careful. You are not yet strong enough. Uh, it's hot down here. Let me help you. Uh, I didn't say I didn't need help from you. Uh, uh. What do I make of your aggression? Does it mean you take responsibility for what's happened to you? Of course, it's all my fault. I didn't mean I... I didn't go to Henry's house. None of this would have happened. Okay. 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 Sorry. Can you really tell me what happened? We didn't know what we were doing. That's a good start. We thought it was going to be fun. It all started when my uncle moved in with us. At first, I wasn't sure. I thought I heard some ladies' voices coming out from my uncle's room. Hey guys, look who we have here. The big boys gang. Yeah. Junior. Yes, How are you guys? Yeah. Fine, what are you watching? I'm watching a live match. Oh, yeah. well, do you guys want to watch something else? Yes, sir. Let's watch a movie. Mm -hmm. Okay. You guys can watch any movie of your choice. As for me, I'm off to my room. Thank you, sir. Wow. Thank you, sir. Wow.
Why are you guys looking at me? Mom, we were going to the kitchen to get some water. I don't trust you guys. Now, you must promise not to say a word about what you've seen to anybody. We were so scared. No, I don't trust you. Move. Now, come closer. Can you see? Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. No, let's watch. Let's watch. Mm -hmm. It's fun. You are big guys now. Let's watch. You are just a little scared, bro. You have nothing to do against an adult. Fear to black daily voice. Ah, it became a habit. I started watching it with my uncle, and each day that passes by without me watching it. It's as if a very big opportunity is passing me by. I just don't know. And then, the worst happened. Hello, my son. I am so happy and grateful to God today for your life. Today marks your 18th birthday. You are a big boy. Unfortunately, your father is now back on his trip. And I and your loving father have decided to give you a special gift. Now close your eyes. That's my boy. Da -da -da. Oh, wow. It's a phone. Yes, you like it so much. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, I'm happy you like it. Happy birthday, boy. <laughs> My parents bought me a phone. Out of love. But it was my greatest undoing. Caleb, you are still in bed and you didn't come for breakfast. I hope you are okay. Oh my God, you're running temperature. Please stand up. Let me take you to the hospital. No, Mom. Don't worry. I'm fine. Are you sure you'll be fine? Yes, Mom. I'll take some pills and then rest. Okay? It's okay. I'm so sorry, eh? All right, Mom. Your dad and I will be going out soon. I will get back. Okay, Mom. Okay? Okay. Take care of yourself. Okay, Mom. I'm not happy with you, Caleb. Honestly, I am not happy. You are disappointing me of late. How can you move from being top of the class to 25th position? Mom, it's not in. Next time I will take first position. And you think it's that easy? Hmm? The boys in your class are envious of you. And all they need is just to find a way to push you behind. Sweetheart, talk to me. I am your mother. What is your problem? It's nothing, Mom. It's nothing. Look, I don't want your father to know about this. Did you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Can I go to sleep? I need to rest because I have some important meetings to attend tomorrow. Okay, Mom. Not me. How were you guys able to do all that? Under the noses of your parents, would have been caught. It was easy because we all have very busy parents. My single father wakes up by 5.30 a.m. every day. 
and by 6.30 a.m. is already out to return to the house by 9 p.m. Daddy. Dad. He would always say the same thing every day. Yet he would be too exhausted to even help me out with any of my assignments. Joe, I noticed you're not saying much about your involvement in this. My mom has a wine bar, but she doesn't care about me. She only cares about her business. Why do you say that about your mother? Because it's the truth. Her night hours were no longer meant for sleep, but to watch porn and masturbate all the time. We always gathered at Harry's house, watching porn with my phone. We thought it was fun. But well, well, wait, guys, uh, I think it's time we go practical. Great suggestion. Mm -hmm. Stop we go, we go practical. Like, what do you mean by that, dummy? It means we should have real sex with real women. Of course. How do we go about that? We don't even have any girlfriends. Of course we do. Chevy, you like Ivy. Of course I do. Mark likes Steph. I like Fee. And Caleb likes... Leah. Go far! That's it. That's how we go about it. So, where do we do it? Um, I'm thinking my house will be fine since my dad is not always around. Ah, guy, I think this will be safer if we get to your hotel. And do it the ladies there. Oh, what if we get caught with the girls in your house? I agree with you. Come on, guys, relax. <sighs> I've told you that my dad doesn't return on time. So, so how do we get them here? That is simple. We just <sighs> tell them to come over for a group study. Oh. Perfect plan. <laughs> That's my guy, man. Exactly. Where are you before? <laughs> no, man, I, I, I don't want to be part of this. Mm -hmm. so come back here. Do you really think you can betray us at this time? I'm not betraying anyone. I'm just trying to do what is right. What you should have done earlier. <sighs> I beg, Henry, continue. So, yeah. the perfect day of the week, I think you can carry out this plan of day on Friday. Yep, I, I agree. That's it. Oh, no. I wouldn't be around on Friday. What do you mean? Where are you going to? I will be on, be on an error for my family. What are you trying to say? Okay, you don't have to miss this. You don't have to miss it. It's my father. I cannot object. Mm. Ah. No, no, no. You don't, you don't have to miss this. Just go and think about it, you know? I have to think about it. I'll, I'll be okay. So Henry is pretty much the brains behind this plan. Those babe, know they come. Why not? They're coming. I want to wait for them. Don't worry, they're coming. I guess they're here. Yeah. Oh, shit. I can hear you. Come to Okay, you guys are very calm. You can have your seats. Have your seats. Yeah, thank you. Hi, girls. Hi. Hi. All right. See, before we continue to study, let me get you guys something to drink. Father 
comes back and finds us here, what are you going to do? Come on, guy, relax. I've got this. What could my dad be doing here by this time? Come on, go, go. Go and have your fun. Sister. Would you good? Yeah. Okay. Just. Oh, come on. Okay. Since the phone is on the ground, let me join you guys. There. Oh, come on. Why not? Join. Bad guy. Omo. The way you take bad, you should be for you. <laughs> That's good, man. Is it because of that small thing? He didn't know your shirt is named like that. Oh, yeah, you. You feel drinker? Of course. Okay, I'm going to pour you a drink now. To prove if you can drink it or you're just bragging. Okay. Just in the mood. Oh, so Whatever. You girls should just drink up because today is our day. <laughs> you guys have no idea what plan we have for you. <laughs> they don't know, they don't know. I, I don't know. You babies should just drink up. Is it, is it babies or baby? Because they are. That, that's too. <laughs> I'm confused. By the way, where is there? Oh, 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 she has shown me she should be here, so I believe she should be here soon. Oh, okay, she should be here soon, okay, okay. Yeah. Huh? Guy, why did you drink water like a fish now? I haven't taken a call before. Oh, Kelly, there's always first time to everything. Oh, my God, I didn't do that too. Kelly, 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 that's it, that's it. Guy, 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 guy. Chala, you now seem more like a man. I didn't do it for you. Who is in for one more? Of course I'm in. I'm in. One more, 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 one Alessa, 
Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, it, it is. Uh, Caleb, yeah, Caleb, sir. Uh, you have to come now. No, no. Uh, yes. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, you have to come. Come. Hmm? Thank you for being honest with me. You made some mistakes, but I believe you've learned from it. Do you know the state your friend is in at the moment because of your foolish plan? No. He had multiple injuries because of masturbation. Injuries that will take time to heal. We're going to have the two of you checked up and placed on medication. Our actions affect our lives, either positively or negatively. There are consequences for every action we make. You two are going to have to keep coming to my office in the next two weeks. We're going to be having counseling sessions back to back with you. Do I have a full cooperation? Yes, ma'am. Meanwhile, I think I'll have your phones. Let me have your phones. They have done enough damage. You're going to have to learn to live without your phones for at least three months. And when the three months are over and we think you have overcome your porn addiction, then we can give them back to you. Your son will recover if all we work together. Doctor, we have our full cooperation. Yes, Doctor. Are you aware that your son is addicted to pornography? What? Um, not exactly, Doctor. Though I had reasons to suspect him, but I waved it aside. What about you, sir? No, um, I'm mostly busy with my work and other things. And you think raising a child in a proper way is not work too? I spoke with your son. I discovered he's going through self-depression. While you are out there making money for your family, sir, your family is the king. I'm not by any means saying work is wrong. I'm of opinion that you should marry work with your family. Have some time. Spend some time with your family. You should know the kind of people our children are fond with. Even if they are relatives, 